Devil worshipping among many pastors and other ministers of the word of God is today becoming widespread and many people are now beginning to worry who is the true servant of God and who is not. There are several pastors in Kenya who have been accused of being in Illuminati, let us look at some of them. Number one on the list is Prophet David Owar. Many people calls him the mighty prophet of God because of all kind of great miracles that he has done before people. However there have been many reports that are emerging of late that the miracles which are done by Prophet David Owar are stage managed meaning that they are fake. The reports indicates that the people who Prophet David Owar claims to have healed are those who surrounds him. The public doesn't know them and they have never seen them. The reports of Prophet David Owar being a member of the Illuminati started spreading like wildfire sometimes back in Kakamega County after one of his drivers walked in and saw Prophet David Owar kneeling down and worshipping a snake-like creature. Prophet David Owar told his driver not to say any word about what he had seen to anyone but the driver deferred the orders of Prophet David Owar and he went ahead to tell his wife. The driver was found dead later on and his wife went publicly to confess what her husband told her about the prophet before he died. Number 2 on the list is Bishop Alan Kiona. Bishop Alan Kiona who is the head of the Jubilee Christian Church has been accused several times of engaging in antichrist activities. He has also been accused of using dark powers which are from the Illuminati society so that he can gather a large crown. Bishop Alan Kiona faced a lot of criticisms from many Kenyans on Twitter and other social media platforms after he invited CNN reporter Richard Quest who is a member of lesbian gay bisexual transgender KELGBTQ to his church in Parklands. Richard stood on the pulpit and talked to the congregation, something that many people didn't agree with. Number 3 on the list is Bishop Thomas Wahome. Bishop Thomas Wahome is the head of the Helicopter of Christ Church a church which has its root from Kaoli but it is now situated in Langata. The inside source revealed that Bishop Thomas acquired his wealth through the link of Illuminati. He is a very wealthy man and he has been involved in a lot of controversies after claiming that he has the power to add someone's name in the Book of Life which is in heaven, that is if the person talks to him nicely. He claims that he also has the powers to remove someone's name from the Book of Life which is in heaven. Thank you for watching this video and please subscribe for more stories.